Welcome back friends. I'm in uh, Baran, I think like close to Dolan. Beautiful scenery. It's a protected uh, landscape and uh, the sea is that way right there. Uh, deep structures, kind of like Cliff Beach and it's kind of close to like Cliffs of Moher which I think is that way. And uh, today we're going to be fishing for Pollock and hopefully we get lucky. Let's see how this goes. Stay tuned. Got a 40 gram jig that caught us a lot of pollock the last time. Got a lot of uh, what do you call white water. I wouldn't be surprised at all if we got some uh, bass over here. The European sea bass. It's actually really dense. Let me not even dig it. See if we can get a bass on that. Oh no, no, no. There you Catch a pollock, I'm gonna keep it. That's why we are fishing from this this high. I won't be able to release the fish, but I'm probably gonna keep it anyway. Fish on! Ah oh, man, came off. I got a pollock. Oh man. I don't like when that happens. Like tiny little guy. Okay, I hope he survives. Sorry buddy. Tiny pollock, jeez. Fish on! Listen! In it! Ha <laughs> ha. 
Alright guys, that's a beautiful uh, pollock. Look at the colors on them. Nice. It's a little too small so we're just gonna get them back in the water and uh, keep fishing and hope that uh, we catch uh, some uh, because it's pollock. Let's see. Okay. I don't know. I don't want to fall. At the same time I hope the fish survives. Another one. Mackerel, I think. Mackerel, I think. That's a mackerel. It is. Heavy though. That's a good size mackerel. Yeah. <laughs> All right, <laughs> here we are. Yeah, that's a decent sized mackerel, you know. Yeah, I think that's a proper size one. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we have a jigging for uh, Pollock, and that guy kind of got the lure. Uh, I think we can fillet, fillet him, right? We can pick him up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We keep keeping him and. Uh, yeah, let's keep fishing. This is nice. Decent one. Yeah, we're keeping this guy if we can get him up. Oh, really good size. <laughs> All right. <laughs> That's a pollock. Excellent size. Yeah, I like it. All right, guys. <laughs> I know that's a small one, but that's still my personal best uh, pollock we're keeping this fish. This is going to be, I don't know, fish and chips, whatever you want to make with it. Grilled. All right, uh, let's uh, get this guy back in the bag. And let's keep casting. Hopefully we get some uh, good fish. Just to be safe. I don't want to hook, hook into your face or something.
Got something. Small mackerel, I think. Yeah, another mackerel. Little guy. I'm stuck there. Fuck. Yep, got it. Ah. Got off. Yeah, at least he fell in the crevice. He'll be able to swim from there. All right. Okay, let's go to the shallows though. It's not feasible fishing from here, you know? Yeah. All right, guys. Uh, I'm finding it hard to, you know, keep the fish. Well, I'm gonna eat the fish, but still like, you know, the one came untagged like in one of the crevices, but I really hope that he was able to get to the water from there. And uh, um, that looks like more accessible. Um, a lot of the times I do catch and release, uh, but this time like, you know, I would like to keep a few fish for the table and if I'm not keeping them, I want them to be safe. So either, uh, that spot more accessible or I'm gonna be fishing right there like you know that that's also like you know closer to the shore so if I'm not keeping fish I can safely release them so that's that's the plan I'm gonna pack up and uh, get to the next spot hopefully we catch some uh, nice fish there like maybe they might hold some bass let's see how this goes and we're back at the house I did uh, try those uh, places that were like, you know, lower and closer to the water, but I had no luck. And shortly after that, I headed to uh, Fonor Beach and I tried for bass, uh, but I had no luck there either. And we drove back and I'm going to be back in India in a couple of days and I will give it a shot for pike before I leave. And if I'm lucky, I will see you with some pike videos. If not, I'll be back home and I will see you guys with some uh, mango jacks, barramundi, grouper the usual and whatnot so stay tuned and uh, thank you for watching see you guys soon